All right, so today I'm going to be talking about a piece of software that I really need for my design, and that is to create the Tesla valve conduit uh, for the airflow system. Um, and I'll explain that in another time, but uh, the software I need essentially inside of Design Spark Mechanical or some other software similar to it, I need to be able to pick a point A and a point B that I need to connect, and then it'll kind of form a line. And then from there, I th pick a third point in order to create a curve. So this will be the path of the conduit. Then it needs to thick, pick another value and that is the beginning width of the conduit and the ending width of the conduit. And then it'll just like average it out. So, then you pick out the direction that you want the air flow or the water flow or whatever uh, you want flowing through your Tesla valve if you're to use this uh, patch for something. So you then pick this way or this way. Um, for the sake of my design, I need it to flow in this direction. So what I need to be able to do is just be able to pick out these values and then it fills in with the complicated pattern of the Tesla valves. So with the direction is that this butt end that's essentially the input end because when the air flows this way it ends up wanting to split and creating this vortex that pushes some of the air against itself as it flows. So it creates more and more resistance as each of these, at, as the air goes into each of these chambers. So on like, over time, it basically makes this that way. It really wants to go only one direction and that's this way because it has a path of least resistance. So that's the software that I need and hopefully it will work for uh, my Bison engine system.